Ranieri, Gabe Rosario, Gabe, what's up to the fight? You with Madonna too. Um, I just thought it was an average fight. You know what I'm saying? Um, I felt like, you know, Madonna came to fight. Felt like Floyd did a lot of running, a lot of holding. But, you know, he did what he had to do to win the fight. So, you know, at the end of the day, he's undefeated. He's going to continue making a lot of money. So, you know, uh, Floyd's just... Floyd knows that all he has to do is win a fight. You know, he really doesn't have to put on a show or anything to get back on and get a big paycheck. All he has to do is win a fight. So that's what he did today. You know, he, he moved a he moved a lot, threw a couple pot shots, then he held. He did enough to win the fight. What did you think about about round eight? You know that 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 Mayweather said, "Oh, he bit me." Um, from what it looked like it, on the replay, it looked like Floyd was kind of cuffing his face. So you know, <laughs> Madonna said, oh, "All right, you want to cuff my face? All right, I'll, you know, he bit him." It was crazy. I didn't, you know, when I saw it in the replay, it was kind of funny. But you know, was it dirty to Madonna bit him? It was very dirty. But at the same time, you know, Floyd's cuffing him and Floyd's getting away with elbows to Madonna's face. So, you know, I can understand Madonna's frustration. And uh, Floyd, has two, Floyd has two fights. Who do you think Floyd will fight out of those two fights? You know, it should be Pacquiao, but I doubt it. You know what I'm saying? I doubt it, you know. This fight's way long overdue, you know, but who knows, man. Anything can happen in boxing. Do you think, do you think one of them could be Keith Thurman? Uh, you know... I don't. I think. I think only diehard boxing fans know who Thurman is. As far as it being a big pay-per-view event, you know, I don't. I don't see how that fight would sell. What about uh, Amir Khan? See Amir Khan, that makes sense because you know he's he has a huge following in the UK, so that makes a lot of sense. So I think the fights right now to make a lot of sense for Floyd are fights like Khan and um, and Pac. Pac, yeah. Yeah. All right. Your thoughts on uh, Jelly on Love? Uh Getting his first defeat. His second defeat. <laughs> second right? defeat. No, man, but, you know, he got caught. It was funny because when I was watching the fight, I was pulling for him. I was, I was pulling for him. I wanted him to win. But when I was watching the fight, he was so off in the beginning, in the beginning part of the fight. It was over in, the, in round three, right? He was so off that I told, um, I was watching the fight with my brother, and I told him, yo, he's going to get knocked out. Because he was so off, his timing was off, and I, I could just see it coming. And um, it happened. When, when you saw Love at the fight, what did you tell him? Oh, nothing. I told him, I mean, I told him to keep his head up. You know what I'm saying? I said, look, shit happens, keep your head up, keep it going. Yeah, why not, man? Um, I think the fans enjoyed it. I think the fans are more intrigued now. The first event was such a success, and the fights were so good. You know, I, all I've been getting was nothing but been getting is nothing but positive feedback. So, definitely, man. What's your message to your fans out there, as well as no, your message just to stay, about, stay about tuned, Philly? Just stay tuned. Stay um, tuned. I got something coming before the year's up. We're working on something big. So, um, you know, I'm just excited. You know, I really can't spill the beans on what's going on, but you know, um, we're working on something big right now. All right, Gabe. Thank you so much. Thanks, man. Appreciate it.